Hello there, my name's Chris Howarth. I'm a former Olympic competitor and national champion, and I'm also the figure skating director here at the Glacier. If you're thinking about going out onto the ice this winter, here's a few tips to help you have fun and stay safe. First of all, it's very important to make sure that your skates fit snugly. Not too large, but not too small. When you're lacing them up, make sure they are nice and firm over the bridge of your foot and around the ankle. As you get higher up the boot, don't pull too tightly, as they may become uncomfortable when you start to skate. Now a little bit about the skate blade. The bottom of it has a radius of somewhere between a 6 and 8 foot circle, depending on the type of blade that you are skating on. This means that when you step out onto the ice, you may feel as though you are rocking backwards and forwards. It is therefore very important to try and get your body weight over the ball of the foot. Once you master this, you will have much better control when you get out onto the ice. So now we have our skates correctly fitted and we understand a little bit about the blade. Let's go through the basic steps on the rubber flooring before going out onto the ice. To help maintain control and balance, you want to keep your knees slightly bent, your hands pressed firmly down and your feet turned slightly out. Once you've acquired this position, practice taking small steps, trying to keep the top half of your body absolutely still. Remember, we want to keep our body weight over the ball of the foot to maintain complete control. Now we're feeling comfortable off the ice, it's time to take our first steps on the ice. The most important things to remember are to keep your knees slightly bent, take very small steps and keep the top half of your body as still as you can. There's lots to remember, but if you emulate the feeling that you had off the ice, you should be fine when you get onto the ice. So now thinking about all the things we have learned, our first steps should be very small, very slow, and stay close to the side of the rink. Once you feel comfortable with these small steps, you can start to glide a little bit but only when you feel ready. This will result in a smooth skating style that will safely get you round the rink. I hope this has helped you. Remember, we've got a team of fully qualified skating instructors that can help you on our Learn to Skate classes or any of our public skating sessions. Remember, have fun and be safe.